you've been doing it the wrong way, um, uh, the, you know, how, how do you move on? You know, I've coached parents to get to the point where they just apologize and say, I really love you, I really want to get to know you, and I'm sorry for, you know, just the pressures and, the, and my own stupidity kept me from being able to ask you the questions I needed and to keep quiet and listen. And um, I've never had any kid reject their parent. My sense is that you really have to work hard to get your kids not to love you, right? There's just this very basic biological, emotional drive. And my sense is that kids will, I mean, unless you've done something horrendous, they'll forgive you. So apologizing and making amends, <laughs> working the 12 steps, <laughs> whatever you've got to do. In other words, you know, just saying, and I, this, I realize that I've been doing something this way, and this really doesn't, it not only doesn't work, but I'm starting to feel it's wrong. And I'm trying to tell you how you should be, but I've, I've never really asked you who you are. So let's go, you know, let's go hang out. Like I advise a lot of my clients to, you know, who I'm working with families, I just say, you know, get out of the family situation, take your son, take your daughter, just go camping. You know, just spend a, f spend a few days together and keep quiet and listen, right? And create that space of resonance. Find, find out what, a, what, a, what the mysteries inside of your child that maybe you've, that they've never shared with you or that you've never really asked about or been open to. Probably the big thing is to, um, to check as a parent, check your own ideas about your children's limitations, right? Because they may be capable of a lot more than you think, right? So challenge them to do more, challenge them to go deeper and to challenge themselves more. I don't think kids ever lose the ability or the desire to connect with or please their parents. Parents can do a lot to snuff it out, but it's pretty strong, you know, and I think they do keep, uh, hope springs eternal and they keep circling back and trying to see whether you'll notice them. So I think if you're open, most come back.